Hi everyone, it's T Auctions for you. Welcome in and welcome to another What's Soul video for the month of May. And I have um, put together my May What's Soul for you guys to see everything we sold. Let me share my screen. All right, I'm gonna rearrange that. There we go. And the first one up here is going to be this Irving Rice round double-sided gooseneck gold tone bendable mirror, five times magnification. Sold this for $39.99 plus $14.95 in shipping. Next one out, this is Celine Sport Women's Washable Silk Beige. Uh, shorts, shorts and summer items picking up um, for the month of May. This was a 1X, got $15.99 plus $7.95 in shipping. It was a pair of nice summer shoes, pink and white, size children's five. They will like brand new. We got $14.99 and, and $9.99 in shipping for the shoes. Had a lot of these come out of a toy unit. This was a Spec Cast 1934 Steerman Biplane 132nd die cast uh, bank. New in box. Had a bunch of these banks. Even brought them some to auction for you guys. So hopefully you guys are cashing in on these. Pulled out $29.99 plus $16.95 in shipping on this one. This one's been sitting around for a while. I did take a best offer. It was a Hollister by Abercrombie. It was a women's hot pink and black stripe pullover top, size large, new with tags. Um, took $12.89 on this one. Even though summer's coming, did a lot of pants sales this month. Uh, this was a Sears and Roebuck uh, from our Sears buy. Uh, cuff jeans, stretch pocket. This was a two, new with tags. Got $13.99 and $9.95 in shipping on those. This was another pair of Levi's uh, jeans, 505, size boys, 14 Husky. 14 Husky seems to be a very popular size. If you see them out in the wild, pick them up. Got $16.95 plus $9.95 in shipping on those. This was a, a, a jacket that was laying around for a while as well. I um, think I had this at some point almost up to $40. Did take a best offer for $24.99 plus $11.95 in shipping. It was a 2X uh, long sleeve green and black with a full zip front. This next item here was part of our die cast lot. Really pretty color, new in box. Um, made by Ertl. It was a 1954 Chevy Corvette 125th scale, $16.99 plus $19.95 in shipping. These were another pair of jeans, women's jeans, Lee Brands, Relax Fit, Straight Leg, Size 6, New with Tags, got $15.99 plus $9.95 in shipping. Here was another die cast. This seems to be a very popular brand. If you guys see that out there, pick these up. This was Brookfield Collectors Guild. This was a Chevy 4x4 die cast. It was a bank um, in this teal blue. Got $34.99 plus $14.95 in shipping for that. This was a 1997 Corvette Sebring Silver. $19.95 and $14.95 in shipping. This was part of an estate sale that I picked up a bunch of Capa de Monte. Uh, this was actually did have a small um, little minor chip on this and it looked like a repair at the bottom, um, but I still managed to squeak out $17.99 on this item, $12.95 in shipping. And thank God we always pray with these, made it safe and sound. Thank you, Robbie, for his awesome packing. 
Here was another Corvette Indy 500 pace car. This was uh, new in box by Revel. We got $16.99 plus $12.95 in shipping. A lot of these promo models, they sell well, you know, in the in the $15 to $20, $25 range, depending on what the model and the make is. Um, but a nice item. If you see these out there, pick them up. They do seem to sell uh, very quickly. Maybe I priced these a little bit on the lower side, but that's okay. They're really moving, uh, which is good. This, this was a um, an awesome piece. This was a Kenner Star Wars Return of the Jedi 1984 B-Wing fighter vehicle. Um, this was pretty new in box. Some of the pieces were still, still sealed. I think some of the um, stickers for the side of the plane were even still carded. Um, I did take a best offer on this of $199. Uh, plus $21.25 in shipping. This came out of um, a storage unit. This was a Corgi 1902 uh, Silver Jubilee for Queen Elizabeth. It was horse and carriage. Uh, this was a, a kind of mounted on plastic. It was plastic as well. Uh, pulled out $39.99 and $16.95 in shipping. This was another Irving Rice silver stand, uh, swivel mirror, one-sided 7X magnification, and we got $34.99, no box, um, and there was a little bit of wear on the base of this. He was a pair of boys Levi's, a 569 cargo green ponderosa pine, 18 regular, and we got $16.95 plus $9.95 in shipping. I do try to get the Levi's anywhere price from $14 to $20. Um, right around this, uh, this, this seems to be the um, kind of the sweet spot of selling them. You know, we start a little bit higher, maybe take a best offer, but that seems to be a good price right around there. This was a vintage sweater that was um, found way back when in a storage unit. Um, it was called Cliff Eagle. It was a men's long sleeve, red and white, size large. Um, did have a little bit of mark on it, but <clears throat> we did manage to pull out $19.99 plus $12.95 in shipping on that one. A little bulky. Um, <clears throat> again, these CDs came out of a New York City DJ collection. Um, been uh, selling a couple every few days and this one was a salsa of the caribbean puerto rican power very good condition most of these were in um really pristine condition um i think i took 9.95 plus um four dollars in shipping on this one here was another revel vintage 1957 chevy bel air uh, new inbox, another promo model, got $19.99 and $12.95 in shipping on that one. Uh, Dockers, again, uh, right in this sweet spot of $15.99, uh, came out of the Sears buy uh, with $9.95 in shipping. Here was another one of these Brookfield collectibles. The Brookfields uh, seem to be going a little bit higher in price, right around $35. Uh, pulled out $34.99 and $14.95 in shipping for this uh, Suburban. Actually sold a VHS. We list them from time to time. I, uh, you know, if I find them in a storage unit or we get a pass at auction for, for any of this stuff, I list it. Sold pretty quickly, too. You know, I'll take the $5 plus the shipping, right? <laughs> it's okay. It's, uh, it, it fills in the gaps. <laughs> This was a pair of Laura Scott's uh, blue cotton shorts, size 3X. All the Laura Scott's came out of the Sears buy. These were all new with tags. And we got $12.99 for these shorts plus $6.95 in shipping. Here was a pair of Dockers men's uh, khaki pants, 3829s, $15.99 plus $9.95 in shipping. 
Here was one of my doll pickups when I bought my big tremendous doll lot. This was a charming chatty Kathy. Took a best offer of $24.99 plus $16.95 in shipping. She had a couple of little condition issues. Um, some lazy eye going on there and I think some spotting or staining on her dress. But we'll take it. This was a pair of slippers, came out of a storage unit. Uh, they were new, just no box, called Secret Treasures, uh, size uh, medium, 7 8 got $12.99 plus $19.95 in shipping. This was uh, more of the Sears clothes. It's called French Toast. I think it is a Sears brand. Um, had a three button front, size 14 short sleeve. Nice little, just cute, um, semi-casual dress for a little boy at $9.99 plus $6.95. Here's a nice summer top by Time and True, women's multicolored floral. I took a best offer of $9 for this plus $6.95 in shipping. These I had um, multiple quantity. Uh, these um, started to sell pretty well now. Uh, 1974 Plymouth uh, Cuda Rally Red. These were dealer promo models. They're new in box. And if you guys see anything that I have multiple quantities, just reach out. Let me know if you're interested. I'll make you a deal on these. $44.95 and $12.95. Uh, golf balls, almost out of stock. These did sell. These are out of stock. These are the Pro Soft Drip Red. 12 in a box new, $24.95 and $9.95 for these. The season is here to golf. Here is a men's short sleeve branded Space Dye Dargan Construction Company of Myrtle Breach, size extra large. Got $9.99 for that and $16.95 in shipping. It was a GI Joe. I took a best offer on this, I believe, of $79.99. Uh, plus $16.95 in shipping, part of my toy lot. This was a first gear Pepsi 1960 Mac model truck uh, trailer. Guys, anytime you see any of this die cast that's branded, any of your uh, soda, beer, all of that sells really well. Um, did take $44.99 plus $16.95 in shipping on this. Bread and butter item. If you guys see filters, car parts, things like that, that are nice and easy to ship um, out there, you know, for 10 bu bucks plus shipping, you know, not nothing to worry about here. Uh, small box ships nice. And um, we try to pick these up when we can. Local garage sales, estate sales, yard sales. They sell great. Here's another AMT Ertl 19... 98 Oldsmobile, um, $14.99 plus $12.95. I sold out of these um, right away, um, probably priced it. Probably probably should have been more like $19.99, but that's okay. They sold right away, and I'm good. This was an unbranded pair of two white doves on a branch ceramic figurine. Did not come with the box, but um, picked this up. Uh, for, uh, you know, probably a dollar or two at a garage sale and got $15.99 plus $12.95 in shipping. Here's another one of these AMT Earls. It was a 1993 Ford Ranger uh, in a dark plum metallic, again, $14.99. This was a pair of new with tags men's dockers, 38.32, got 15.99 and 9.95 in shipping. This top's been laying around for a while. I think I got this even back on Long Island. Traveled all the way here to South Carolina with us, so I took a best offer of $10. Uh, Style and Company women's tunic gray long sleeve scoop necked uh, top, kind of like that sweater top with a uh, skirted like bottom size extra large this was cute i picked some of these up from betty next door um when she went out of business at the consignment shop she had a lot of summer and pretty stuff like butterflies and things like that 
Um, so I think I have maybe $2 into this. It's called Bloss Blossom by Women. It was a uh, cover up, uh, one size fits most, $14.99 for this plus shipping. This was part of the Sears Bias also. This was a craft Craftsman uh, white pair of men's overalls um, with those nice deep and snap pockets. Uh, got $29.99 plus $14.95 in shipping for this pair. More golf balls again. I'm out of stock on these Vice Pros as well. I think for most of the Vice Pros now, I have very limited quantity. If you guys want um, or are interested in any golf balls and want to go take a look and see what I have left, reach out, let me know. And we certainly can make you a deal on what's left. This was a pair of old Navy size six mustard colored high rise uh, skinny. And they were $12.99 plus $7.95 in shipping. Here was a Viamore women's shift dress. Again, another item I picked up from Betty. She had multiple quantities in this in different sizes. This was a size large. Um, I had gotten two of uh, these from her, sold out on this, $19.99 um, plus shipping. Had a lot of seven boxer briefs, uh, Hanes, new without tags, $16.99 for the package of seven. Here was another pair of Old Navy uh, ankle pants in mauve, $12.95 for these as well. I think that I, I'm almost positive the same buyer for these in the mustard, um, if I'm not mistaken. Here was another pair of Dockers, new with tags, men's $32.30. Got $15.99 plus $9.95 in shipping on those. This was another thing over um, I got from Betty. We had picked up a bunch of these in different sizes. Uh, they called Capella Women's Swim Cover-Ups. This was a multicolored paisley, um, a size 3X, new with tags. Got $15.99 plus $6.95 in shipping as well. Sold this uh, New York NFL Buffalo Bills uh, Alonzo, Kiko Alonzo, Nike, um, on-field jersey, size 2XL. I um, think I took a best offer on this for $49.99 plus $9.95 in shipping. This was another pair of Laura Scott's Nick Capri leggings in an olive, size 3X, new with tags, $12.99 plus $6.95. This was another pair of charcoal gray men's dockers for $15.99, size 30-32, and $9.95 in shipping. This was a 1997 Chevrolet C3500 in emerald green, a pickup truck um, in plastic. AMT Ertl again, $14.99 plus $12.95 in shipping. Here's some more Laura Scott. Women, women's a-line knit skirt in a gray heathered stretch, size extra large, also new with tags. Laura Scott seems to sell really well, guys. Again, if you see this out in the wild, it's kind of a bread and butter brand, but it's comfortable. Women seem to like it. So if you see it out there, obviously it was a staple with Sears. And um, since there's a lot of um, out of business uh, things this is this brand may have gone away. I'm not really sure, but you should check it out if you see it in the wild. This is part of our sports buy we did with Brian Mr. Buys a lot, and this was a Majestics MLB Boston Red Sox. This was Jacoby Ellsbury number 46 in an adult size extra large, new with tags. Um, this was a repeat customer. If you notice up here, is this is our extra 20% off with code catch more. And I'll leave those coupon codes in the description for you guys as my customers. If you would like to use the coupon codes, feel free to, to purchase anything in the store or let me know and I will certainly um, cut you a nice deal. Got $8.99 plus shipping on that one. This was a lot of seven um, space technology books. Um, 
pick these books up at an estate sale. Any transportation like space, railroad, cars, you know, automobiles, they, they always sell well. So anytime you see transportation books, you know, I got seven books here for almost seven for seventy-six dollars plus twenty dollars in shipping. Um it's a great deal. It, it, it's it's great. Transportation is great. Um, just sale. Just know that. I uh, had this pair of Louis Raphael Hidden Extension Men's Charcoal Gray Pants. Uh, 30 to 32. New with tags. Got $15.99 for those plus $9.95 in shipping. And uh, the last item here is the Banda Gorda. Uh, it's a Spanish CD. Uh, took a best offer at um, $10.99 plus $5.95 in shipping. And those Spanish CDs are selling, selling, selling. So hopefully you guys were able to pick some of those up in my auction. Um, and um, let me go back here. And yes. So thank you so much, guys, for coming in to another What Sold video for the month of May 2023. Again, I'm T. I'm known as Auctions, the number four, the letter U. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for those of you who'd like to come over to my other channel, Team T Academy. Uh, that is my website or my YouTube channel is just simply Team T Academy on over here on YouTube. I do have educational material up on there for resellers as well as businesses. Um, check the description below for any links. And we look forward to seeing you on the next video. Have a nice day.